Introducing Fellow's line of desk side auto feed shredders, the Automax 200C and 130C, which allow you to shred automatically and get back to business. Keep watching for essential information for easy, trouble-free operation. Plug in and put disconnect power switch in on position. For automatic shredding, open lid and add paper. Paper should be flat and aligned with front of paper tray. Close lid and press start to begin shredding. Once the shred cycle has started, do not open the lid as the shredder will not run when the lid is open. For manual shredding, simply feed paper straight into paper entry and release. To manually shred a credit card or CD, DVD, hold at edge, feed straight into paper entry, and release. Note that the manual feed cannot be used while auto feed is in use. The 200C will shred for up to 12 minutes and the 130C will shred for up to 10 minutes before needing a 25 minute cool down period. The primary features of the Automax 200C and 130C are as follows. A disconnect power switch for complete shutdown a LED control panel featuring essential controls and icons, a manual feed paper slot, a lid latch to access the auto feed paper tray, the pull-out bin, and casters for easy mobility. Please read all safety instructions before shredding, or for more information, visit fellows.com. Now let's look more closely at the control panel. The blue on-off button turns the shredder on or off. The forward arrow button begins the shredding cycle. The reverse arrow button reverses paper in case of a paper jam. The bin open icon indicates that the bin door is open and needs to be secured before shredding. The bin full icon indicates when it's time to empty the bin. The remove paper icon indicates a paper jam inside the machine. The overheat icon indicates the shredder needs time to cool down before continued shredding. Automax features the following shredding capabilities. It can automatically shred 8.5 by 11 inch paper, standard staples, standard paper clips. Note that you will need to pull apart more than 20 sheets of paper stapled or paper clipped together. The 130C can shred up to eight sheets manually, as well as eight and a half by 14 inch paper, credit cards, and folded paper. The 200C can shred up to 10 sheets manually, as well as eight and a half by 14 inch paper, credit cards, CDs and DVDs, junk mail, and folded paper. The Automax will not shred. Adhesive labels, bound documents, binder clips, more than 20 pages stapled or paper clipped together, staples in the top center of paper, laminates, folded paper in the auto feed tray. Please refer to the operations manual for a complete list of materials that cannot be shred. To maintain the performance of your Automax, you will occasionally need to oil the shredder and clean the auto start infrared sensors. All cross-cut shredders require oil for peak performance. Under or over oiling a machine could lead to issues such as diminished sheet capacity, intrusive noise when shredding, and it could ultimately stop running. To avoid these problems, we recommend you oil your Fellows Automax shredder each time you empty your waste bin. To oil, open the shredder lid. Carefully apply oil across cutters Make sure to not get oil in the paper tray. Close lid. Press forward button. Only use non-aerosol vegetable oil in a long nozzle container such as Fellows 35250. Paper detection sensors are designed for maintenance-free operation. However, on rare occasions, the sensors may become blocked by paper dust causing the motor to run, even if there's no paper present. To clean the auto start sensors, turn off and unplug shredder. 
Open lid and locate auto start infrared sensor located in the center of the paper entry. Dip a cotton swab in rubbing alcohol. Using the cotton swab, wipe away any debris from paper sensors. When the overheat indicator is illuminated, the shredder has exceeded its maximum operating temperature and needs to cool down. This indicator will remain illuminated and the shredder will not operate for the duration of the recovery time. The shredder will not run if the bin is open. When illuminated, close the bin to resume shredding. When illuminated, the shredder waste bin is full and needs to be emptied. Use Fellows Waste Bag 36053. When illuminated, press the reverse button, open lid, and remove paper. Note that if paper is not shredding through the auto feed tray, check the position of the paper. Paper should be flat and aligned with the front of paper tray.